Well, hi, Brian and Janie here, Allegro Piano Service, and I'm here to talk about something that is really disturbing. I come across more pianos than I want to think about that have had rodent infestations. I've come across wonderful grand pianos in beautiful living rooms and people were completely unaware that they had had a four-legged visitor. Yes, people that didn't even know they had mice. And I see a cat in their house and their cat is well fed. Maybe they should consider how they feed their cat, but their cat is not helping them. So I wanted to make a few recommendations in regards to taking care of such scary circumstance. I've literally seen pianos destroyed by rodents. They love the insides of pianos. It's like, you know, a metropolis in there with spires and interesting wire and all sorts of superstructure. And they love to chew on piano actions, the felt, the, the cotton, the things that are inside of it. And they love to nest. Sometimes they bring their food in with them. Sometimes they have children in them. Again, and this is one thing that I found that's very helpful. These little rodent repellent electronic gizmos. If you have an electric plug near your piano, this is a great thing to just put in there to just make sure the little critters are not around. They apparently it makes some supersonic noise that only they hear and it's like, you know, a herd of pterodactyls coming at them or something like that and they don't come near. Or you can get from me or anywhere really this uh, botanical rodent repellent pack that you can put inside the piano and that uh, it smells really nice. It smells like potpourri. My daughters tell me it smells like Christmas. Uh, but it has something in it that uh, rodents don't like in regards to smell. This can be very helpful in keeping uh, critters out of your piano. It's also my recommendation, and of course, as you've seen in other videos, that before you have, uh, before you acquire a piano, that someone like myself come look at it first. I've had many, many instances where people have had pianos shipped from across country, or they've had them... Uh, you know, they've acquired them off of local Craigslist ads, Facebook ads, or something like that. And they don't know anything other than just a few keys stick. And then I open it up and discover that it's been a hotel for mice for years. And that basically the inside of the piano is toast. I hope this is helpful. And uh, if you have any questions about rodent infestations, do be in touch. This is Brian Janey with Allegro Piano Service, and thanks for watching.